Big Boy Grill Restoration Part 3. You've seen these photos already. This is getting to the finishing part. The rotisserie motor. There's the gearbox with the rotisserie motor. Try to keep everything as vintage as possible as I could. Here's the lid, the top, the stainless steel. I'm getting good polish on it. There's the front exterior looking good. This is the back side of the rotisserie motor, the, uh, the gears. There's the gears and chains as I'm putting everything back together. What a cool complex of uh, ingenuity for the time. There's the uh, table top that I started making. I went ahead and burned in the wood so I can get a good uh, finishing glaze on it. There's a tap and die set that I used to um, make uh, the handles in the uh, rotisserie uh, bars. Getting them things ready to put a finish on them. There's the paint procedure. Did it two different ways so I can have two different textures of the colors. Here's the uh, the on and off switch that I added, which it didn't come with it, but I added one. I thought it would be a good idea. Went ahead and built a um, electrical box with all the electrical components in it to keep it out of the weather and looking nice. There's the grill with the fire going. What do y'all think? Time to fire this baby up and do some cooking. <laughs> 